Hey everyone, it's me Sherry. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Sherry and I try to do videos every Tuesday and Thursday. If you like what you see, feel free to subscribe down below. It's free and hit that little notification bell so that you will be notified when I upload new videos. So for today's video, I'm going to do my empties video. So my empties are not going to be just empties anymore. They're going to be empties, fails, and products that I changed my mind on. Okay, so that's what I'm doing. Um, so we're going to talk a little bit about some products that I finished up, some products that I couldn't finish up. Okay, so the first thing is these Aveeno Positively Radiant Makeup um, makeup Removing Wipes. Uh, these are just fine. They dried out near the end, so I don't know if I'd repurchase. But I do have another pack here that came in a set for Christmas. Um, so I am going to use those up. The next product that I have in here, uh, let's see if we can do it somewhat in order. Okay, this is kind of a random product. This is for Breeze Air. Um, this is with the Gain, and this is Island Fresh. Just, I don't know why I put this in here, but we did use this up. It smells nice. Does the job. Um, geez. All right, um, I can't do it in order. It's just random products. The next product that I have is the Orchard and Vine, Orchid and Vine, Orchard, sorry, and Vine <laughs> Vanilla Coconut Bath Soak. This was just fine. It was a bath soak, bath salt, you know. Um, I also have this. This came from the dollar store. Um, this is the Bath Sense Bath Fizzy, and it's in Mango Tango. It was all like rainbow colors like unicorn i've had those a few times they're not bad they're not as good as lush but they're not bad the next product that i have is avon footworks it's just a lavender scented foot cream what i like to do with this is put it on my feet like thick layer and leave it this is an overnight one i think yeah it's an overnight cream leave socks on and just uh, leave it all melt into the skin it's pretty good i'm not going to repurchase that one though because i have a different kind so that I like and probably talk about that in another empties video at some point. This was the O2 Bubble Anti-Pollution Mask. I did like a masking video on this. This was kind of cool. It really foamed up like my face was like foam. Um, I would probably repurchase that again or try another um, bubble mask. This one I got at Walmart. It was like three dollars or something like that. Uh, what else do we have in here? Well, I didn't realize how many empties. Let's save the, um, the makeup related products for last because that's what a lot of people are interested in. And those are kind of more fails. This is the Clarins Multi Active Nuit. It's like a night cream. This was pretty good. You know what though? This was a sample or a point perk that I got from Sephora or one of the freebies. I can't remember. But it was like half empty when I got it. So that kind of sucked. But whatever. And along the lines of moisturizer, I got the First Aid Beauty Coconut Water Cream. I had this in my recent favorites. I really do like this. I might consider purchasing the full size. But I have other samples of moisturizers and some moisturizers that I got in BoxyCharm that I got to go through first. Just to kind of make up my mind on what I want. For sure. Um, this is the Drunk Elephant Poly peptide cream proteiny polypeptide cream i wasn't really particularly fussy for this i found it a little thick i don't know i know a lot of people really like that but i found it a little thick this is the pure la fire white almond it's a moisturizer this was okay i got that in a i can't remember what i got that in i'm sorry stars barking um it wasn't, I don't get Fab Fifth one. It wasn't in a boxy charm. It was in something else that I got. This is the Peter Thomas Roth Firm X Peeling Gel Exfoliant. This mask was incredible. This is really good if you want to resurface your skin. Really like that. So obviously I'm doing my empties first. Um, and this is the Drunk Elephant Bestie Number no. 1 Jelly Cleanser. I liked that though. I did like this one. And what's this other sacket? This is the Laneige Water Sleeping Mask. This was really nice as well. So those are my empty products. I do have one product here. Well, I have 
okay i do have this from <laughs> i'm getting all confused here sorry guys i do have this from color pop it dried out this is in the color pop rock so i have to get rid of that so it's technically not finished but i have to get rid of it same with the and plus this isn't cruelty free so this is the maybelline fit me concealer which is a shame because there's still quite a bit of it in there but i have to pass that okay so some products that i changed my mind on the first one is this essence eyebrow definer i don't the color is okay but i don't really like the product that much and the other thing is and this is, i hate saying this as well but the essence fresh and fit awake makeup maybe it's just because it got older but it just it doesn't feel like it was the same some i'll use it sometimes when i'm just filming because sometimes when i'm filming i'll put makeup on film and then take it off again so for those purposes sometimes i'll use it. it it does have a little bit of a dewy finish so if you like that you'd like it but maybe it's just because it's older it's getting old maybe the formula changed a bit but i changed my mind on this for sure so i might still keep it in my collection like i said to use it to film but i might just toss it because it's it's coming up on about a year how long does this last for 12 months so yeah maybe i'll just toss it um, and then I have two mascaras that were a fail. This Wonder Unlashed Volume and Curl Mascara. I do not like this at all. I don't like it. It doesn't do anything for my lashes. I'm tossing that out. And then this Gerard Mascara Last Boosting Formula. This was okay, but look what happened. <laughs> so I can't use that. That's useless to me. The wand cracked off. That came from like a boxy charm. So I'll be tossing that as well. So those are some products that I emptied that failed or that I changed my mind on. Is there anything that you guys have been using up lately or loving or something that failed for you? I like to hear things that failed for people as well because if it failed for somebody that has similar skin type and colors and stuff to me or like that I know like there's one that is red Vanessa here on YouTube I uh a lot of the mascaras that she likes I like so I guess we have kind of the same personal taste so with mascara because mascara is a personal thing but um yeah the um if there's anything you guys have been loving or hating recently let me know down below or anything that you finished up that you'd like to share and i will talk to you guys on my next video bye everyone